one. Hello and welcome to a contest of colossal meaning. We find ourselves here just to the north of the Doha city center, ahead of the 2022 World Cup final. My name is Derek Ray, and with me to provide expert analysis is Stuart Robson. And as you can imagine on this occasion, the atmosphere is building up nicely. It's Argentina versus France. Well, what an occasion for these two sets of players. A chance to be world champions. Let's hope the game matches the atmosphere. It should be an absolute cracker. I can't wait for this to start. The Argentina first team. Well, it's a defensive looking lineup, but if the wing backs break forward, the midfield can get close to the front pair and the front two can link up with each other. They should still cause problems today. Here's the side France will go with. Hugo Lloris is the goalkeeper. Rafael Varane plays with Dayo Ibamecano in central defence. Kylian Mbappe starts with Usman Dembele in the wide positions. And getting the vote of confidence in attack today, Olivier Giroud. And now they get the ball rolling. Griezmann just the challenge that was required so this is it for Argentina World Cup winners in 1978 and 1986 runners up in 1930 1990 and eight years ago in 2014 are they going to do a it? big moment here Derek and a goal it is the keeper really not part of the equation Well, here it is again. It's an easy finish in the end, but what was the keeper thinking? That's a poor bit of defending. So France get the ball rolling once more. We're about to find out how they're going to react to the setback. Kunde. Promising attack, this. Gives it a go! A smart stop here. Now sending it in. Well, still an issue here. And the keeper there to deal with it. Another corner conceded. What can they do with this one? Over it comes. Superb block. And the referee sees that as a foul. Free kick given. <laughs> now.
Messi. Fine work from France to win back possession. Teo Hernandez. Mbappe. Griezmann. Dembele. Might it be Olivier Giroud? That is a really disappointing effort. Goodness me. On that occasion, just didn't make the right sort of contact. Should be testing the goalkeeper from that sort of range. Enzo Fernandez. Well clattered away. He has teammates around him. Messi. You'll be hard pressed to find a better save than that. Loris. A short corner. Lionel Messi. Otamendi. Otamendi has it. Getting the better of his opponent. Can he take the chance? Giroud. France moving the ball forward. What can they do from here? And he takes it on. Oh, goal it is! The equaliser in this final. What next in the drama? So back underway, they've levelled it at 1 1 here. Number 14, Adrian Rabio. Lisandro Martinez. McAllister. Chance to do damage. But nothing comes of it. Dembele. Rabio. Dembele on the ball. He's got to have a go here. And that, a piece of goalkeeping, you're going to see again and again and again. And played short. Dembele with the cross. It might still be problematic. Giroud spot on with that tackle and the throw in here for France Rabiot good physical play it did look on for them but not to be now well Molina Fernandez on to Messi Alvarez well tremendous block Upamecano Upamecano now Giroud Griezmann France looking dangerous here 
Griezmann. Dembele must take the lead here. Oh, it's a goal! A celebratory moment as they jump in front. Well, I have to say, he's done really well here. He's in the right place and then a decent finish. That's a good goal. And the ball is moving again. Anyone's guess how this is going to finish? 2-1 currently. Kylian Mbappé. McAllister. Now Romero with it. De Paul. Rodrigo De Paul. Well, it looked as though it had a chance of going in. Well, he should make the keeper work there, but you sense a goal is coming. Well, there it is. France just haven't had as much of the ball, but their attacking play has been really incisive. It's been a really good display from them so far. Olivier Giroud. He's in with a chance. Well, he stumped it out of there without much fuss. Giroud. High quality defending. Upamecano. Aurelia Chuameni. Jules Kunde on the ball. Griezmann. Giroud. Determined defending. Two minutes of stoppage time coming up. And they stopped them in their tracks. Lionel Messi. How about the cross? Marcos Acuna. Must score! A really sound goalkeeping. Well, that's such a good save, isn't it? How did he keep that one out? Fired over by Messi. Well, not cleared away completely. Now the managers will now deliver their half-time team talks. We're at the end of 45 minutes in... And the ball is moving again, with France looking to build on a largely positive first-half performance here. to call that a squandered opportunity Stuart well what a waste that is it's far too easy for the keeper he should have made him work harder there over the touchline for what will be a France throw Dembele Giroud and fed forward he got in the way of that cross. Well, shielding the ball admirably. Messi. Here's Alvarez. Well, possibilities in the centre. Oh, lovely. 
lovely weighted ball. They might be in. Radio. Now the keeper grabs it. Fernandez. Marcos Acuna. He has teammates around him. Messi. And a good challenge to bring that attack to an end. Well, let's see what they have in store for them on the break. But they took care of the situation defensively. Griezmann. Promising move this from France. And the advantage accrues to the attacking side. Could cross it in here. Rabiot. Oh, incredible save, and he snuffed out any sign of danger. Well, they have elected to go to the bench at this stage of the game. And deciding to go short with this one. And after the cross, a tremendous block. No hiding from the fact that they really should have extended their lead. Well, that was a poor miss. Could they come to regret that? Romero and the pass not quite accurate enough and a throw in then so making the substitution now Hernandez now with Rabio. Mbappe firing it towards goal very much run of the mill as saves go well possession seeded Teo Hernandez Mbappe Griezmann they had to react and did do like to press whenever they can and that's very good refereeing to let the play flow Rodrigo de Paul and under pressure that was a fine claim Olivier Giroud can they create something from here Well, nothing comes of it. It looked promising. Messi. Messi. Making sure it didn't get past him. Well, France have had all the ball in the last 15 minutes and have been pressing to extend their lead. They just need to be a bit more clinical in front of goal. Yes, it's going to plan, and they might be able to carve out another chance. Griezmann and space to cross it however a well thought out piece of defending a foul but advantage played Marcos Acuna Otamendi De Paul Fluency of movement. Good pass. Well, able to close down the shot. And the referee felt he had to blow the whistle. Well, following on from the previous incident, he sees yellow now. And the substitution will occur now.
Super Meccano. Teo Hernandez. Giroud. And now Rabio. And return to Giroud. This could be it. A really good stop at the critical stage. Well, had that gone in, there was no way back. Not much time left now, though. He's driven in the corner. Not all that convincing defensively. Griezmann. Olivier Giroud at the ready. Well, no problems defensively. Retaining possession proving difficult. Rabiot. Well, there's still scope for late drama here. Five minutes left and just one goal between the sides. Argentina will get the throw in. Time for a change then. How about the cross? Marcos Acuna. Now sliding in field. Paredes must score. And Varane foiling them. to get tighter here great block well they'll be looking to add to their advantage from this corner so a personnel change then and a short corner here too much height on that one. Close shave, though. And three minutes of stoppage time to be added on. De Paul. Di Maria now. Lisandro Martinez. Mbappe with it. Well, here it is again, and it's all about the pace in transition. They're so quick to get out from the back, and his movement's so clever. Once he gets onto it, there's only one thought in his head. Smash it as hard as possible. What a good goal. about it Derek they've been the best team in the tournament France the world champions it takes a massive effort to win back-to-back -back World Cups but Stuart that's what France